Hey, what's going on, guys? Oink here, and I'm bringing you some uh, some Modern Warfare 3. Um, the map is called Fallen, I think, and I'm playing some Kill Confirmed, and I didn't quite manage to catch the time of day it was, but whatever time it was, uh, I, I'm pretty sure it must have been midday at some point because no one else was online. Um, and I kind of, I just had a, an urge to want to play some Call of Duty. You know, despite the fact that I'm not the biggest fan of this game, as many of you are now well aware of, I'm sure. Uh, I do, you know, I am a I am a Call of Duty player. I've been playing it for a long time. And sometimes it just really is quite tempting to, to get on and play, play some. And, uh, and so I decided that I would hop on here. And I usually don't play for more than, you know, an hour or so when I'm playing Call of Duty. Because it does just frustrate the hell out of me. Um, in many ways, but I won't go into that because you know you're all well aware of my frustrations with the game. Um, but it is it is some gameplay for you, just because. And I was trying to explain this to a mate of mine earlier that yes, I don't play the game massive amounts, and I did kind of hate on it to begin with. But I I do like to do YouTube, you know, as well as what it, as what it's what I'm playing. I do like to do you know my videos because of what you guys want to see you know I, I part of the reason why I do this is because you know it gives me satisfaction that people are enjoying and are enjoying what I'm putting out and uh, if Modern Warfare 3 is something that you enjoy then um, by all means I'm happy to continue posting that as long as I can get the uh, the occasional gameplay from when I do go on uh, so that's what I got for you today and I'm going to be using uh, the scar with a silence I don't know if I'm using this for the entire game but uh, this is what I started out with and I've just been Messing around with some stuff, and um, and I usually use those support kill streaks. I think it's like a UAV and uh, a stealth bomber, and I think this is the the gunner which drops you care packages and stuff. Although I've usually been using the um, special UAV or whatever it's called. Uh, is it advanced like UAV or something? That's the main one I've been using. But I just got this Osprey gunner, I think it is, and it's pretty it's pretty awesome. I don't know, it gives you loads of care packages and stuff. And um, and it defends them as well, so you can usually get them without them being stolen. So it's really cool. I don't know. It seemed quite quite good to me. Um, and actually, it paid off quite nicely in this one because I did get something quite nice with it. But I don't want to give too much away because uh, you know it's, there's no point spoiling uh, spoiling what's to come. You will be able to see that in due time. Um, what I did want to say is, other than that uh, little Skyrim video that I posted the other day, I haven't posted anything since my my sort of uh, video login thing in my bedroom, my setup video, um, which by the way I do hope you enjoyed, um, and a few people told me to tidy my bedroom, and I was kind of thinking, you know, why do I need to tidy my bedroom, that's what my bedroom looks like, you know, no point giving you a misrepresented account of what my bedroom looks like, and, and failed pistol switches, I switched to a stinger launcher there, <laughs> um, but yeah, this is my first video from doing that. And so I did want to talk about a few things which are kind of related actually back to to getting 1,000 subscribers. Now, uh, first off, you know, 1,000 is quite a lot of people. Um, of course, not everyone is watching my videos, uh, every every video I post. Um, but, you know, that's not a problem. You know, it, it means a lot that you, you know, felt you liked the videos enough to, uh, to hit the subscribe button in the first place. Um, and you know the, the video, the, the view counts are, are you know generally improving on my videos, which is you know it means a lot to me. If more people are watching it, of course it's not about the views. You know I don't, I don't mind if there's not so many views in a video, and I don't try and view haul every video if that makes sense. I don't just put up stuff that's going to get views and disregard anything that's not going to get views because you know I'm just gonna I'm gonna mainly post what you know what I, I want to post really, um, and and what I think you guys are going to enjoy, but not all of you will like all myself, of course. Um, and, and yeah, so it's, it's cool that, you know, more people are watching the videos, um, and that sort of thing, so, you know, in, in response to having a bigger viewership, I'm gonna try and, uh, and step my channel up a bit, so first off, I've had my Portal 2 background for a little while, and I was quite pleased with it when I first made it, and it was quite easy for me, because it was an easy way to theme it, I could just think, right, I'm doing this Portal, it was when I did my Let's Play, for those of you that have subscribed recently, I did a Portal 2 playthrough Let's Play thing, um, and I kind of made it for that, and it just kind of stuck, because I did quite enjoy it, um, and it looks quite clean and, and quite nice, so I have stuck with it for quite a while now, and I think that it's kind of time for something new, 
I had originally planned to do it at a thousand to release a new a new background and all that. But what happened with, th there was the new YouTube layout and they kind of put it half in, like there was the beta and you could choose whether or not to uh, to use the new layout and the new um, the new channel layout for it as well. And um, so I thought, well, why not just wait until they fully released it and everyone's using this layout and then put one out. Um, as far as I'm aware, they've kind of started putting it, I mean, when I came back onto YouTube, the other day, yesterday, I think it was, you know, that it came up with the new layout automatically. It didn't give me the choice like it had been before. So I don't know if that means they're kind of pushing it now. Um, but I am going to start working on a new background for my channel in the new layout. And that will be going up sometime soon. I get a nice little quad feed there with the with the airstrike and the sentry gun, which is quite cool. Um, and uh, so, yeah, so that's something I'm going to be working on. Do something in Photoshop, try and make it look nice, try and make it look clean. Um, another thing which I've been thinking about but I haven't started yet is um, again kind of linked to the fact that I'm you know getting more viewers now is um, thinking of starting doing uh, either a Facebook or a Twitter or both even I haven't you know decided one or the other and I haven't set them up you know like I said this is just something that I've been considering um, because a lot of people do you know use Facebook and Twitter either more than they use YouTube or they find it easier to uh, to you know keep up with people via it and uh, and for that reason, you know, I think if I if I do incorporate that with my videos or my channel or what what have you, then that will help some of you guys stay in touch with me. And of course, it's 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 really easy via those uh, mediums to actually just you know keep keep in touch with you guys personally as as well as just videos. So I mean, I've, of course, I would probably um, put links to any videos that I post on there just for those of you that use that more than anything else. Um, but at the same time, I would you know. Put any you know any gaming related stuff that I'm interested in. If I find any cool links for uh, news articles, I'm often reading up about uh, new games and technology and stuff. So that kind of stuff would go on there. Um, this is all hypothetical, of course. You know, I haven't set up any of this yet, but this is just what I'm thinking. Um, if you guys think that's a good idea, um, you know, let me know. If, if you want to uh, put some comments in in the comment section, you can let me know if you've got any opinions on that. If not, then uh, don't worry, and I'll make my own mind up about that. Um, and uh, also, um, sort of, uh, my, my, my friend again was sort of suggesting that I get an intro for a video, or even an intro and an outro. Um, and I actually, I started thinking about that a little while ago. I, I downloaded myself uh, Cinema 4D. Um, for those of you that don't know what that is, it's kind of like a 3D animation-y sort of um, thing where you can, you know, build little... 3D animations. If you see it, most with sort of a lot of bigger YouTubers have those kind of 3D text ones or little, um, you know, three-dimensional videos, and a lot of them are created at least partially using Cinema 4D. And I kind of gave it a go. Uh, I kind of sort of self self-taught myself a few tricks. Um, most of it was pretty basic. You know, I didn't really get that far with it. And in the end, I, I just sort of, sort of thought, well, I don't, I'm not really needing an intro. It's not something that I really want to spend a lot of time doing. And so I didn't do one in the end, but, um, you know, I've got that and my friend was telling me that I should think about doing one. And so, um, you know, I might consider that and I might have a look at, you know, continuing to try and learn that as well. And um, and hopefully get a bit better with that and then I'll have an intro. Um, so those are a few things, you know, just that I've been thinking about. And if there's any other suggestions on that kind of very sort of like new stuff or um, that sort of thing that you guys want to give me feedback on, um, be sure to let me know, you know, send me a message or uh, drop a comment or any of that sort of stuff. Um, in terms of some videos coming up, I've got, uh, I think I've got um, a Battlefield gameplay, I've been been getting back on Battlefield actually, um, my, my mate Novax, uh, you know, we, we went on a trophy hunt and uh, both of us now have got every single trophy except for the one which you need to get when you get to level 45, um, so we're both one trophy off getting that platinum which is always a nice one so I've been getting more into that and just uh, you know it'd be nice to get that one done so it's likely that there'll be some more battlefield on the way some more uh, you know battlefield gameplay for you guys um, but I have got one lined up ready and um, perhaps uh, another one and I think maybe even some another Skyrim I think I, I might have um, one person was suggesting that uh, I, I have a look at Maybe doing some some tutorials or something in Skyrim for some certain you know areas of magic or something, um, but I'm 
unaware of what to do th with that. But yeah, just there's a few things to look forward to or expect from me in the near future. And that's my phone ringing. Um, let me just chuck that away. Yeah, just had to chuck my phone away. It was making a racket, and you guys probably all heard that. And then gonna have to go and ring them back, whoever that was. And it's still fucking ringing. Do they not get the idea? Oh well. Um, there's the end of the game. So my final score is 46 and 50. Nearly got that 50 kills, but not quite. Um, and we won the kill confirmed there. Oh, by one kill as well. I only just saw that. We won by one kill, or one c confirmation kill anyway. Well, that was a pretty. Pretty close game, awesome. I didn't even realise it was that epic. Well, anyway, hope you enjoyed the game. Uh, I'll catch you guys soon. Peace out, guys.